All right, members, this video is spe specifically for you. I can't talk. All right, so I did a thing. So I have been making some amazing returns. Um, I'm net positive a good amount everywhere from Pulse Chain, thanks to PTGC, UFO, all of them coins, thanks to Solana, the token, thanks to Solana meme coins, thanks to Titan X. The miners, the stakes, they're coming out. Bro, overall, with everything, it's looking great. Let alone Bitcoin going up. Of course, that side of the world is way up. So I'm blessed to be where I'm at. And I decided to do diversify my portfolio even more. And I would, I would recommend, I would suggest at least looking into this. Because you may never know what could happen. The overall pulse chain right now is definitely skyrocketing everything in in pulse chain i think it's even on top of ethereum right now it's like second place from ethereum and hex token is actually going up so i i'm go i diversified portfolio already on my main wallet i went i went ahead and did this but i i also did this on my dummy wallet to show you guys on youtube um but i sold some great profits from a little bit of everything, Tynex and, and Pulse Chain and PTGC, you know, all that stuff. So the funds came from everywhere. And I combined it all to get into Hex. This, I got in at two and a half cents. I'm, well, I'm sorry, not two and a half cents. Zero, zero, two, five. And then I bought my second half at zero, zero, three, five. Okay, so that's whenever I got in. I'm already up 2x pretty much from whenever I bought. I, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty confident this was the bottom. This was it. Like, if you did not buy around here, that would be bad. <laughs> like, come on now. So, even though it's at 005, it still has some great odds of it going crazy again. Even 5 cents is doable, right? 5, 10, um, 20 cents would be my guess to be the best case scenario, but... As you guys can see on the screen, I went to Hex website. If you don't know what it is, I will leave the CoinGecko website down below in the description. I don't know how YouTube is going to react if I leave this Hex website. I don't know if it's going to demonetize it. I don't know if it's going to block my YouTube video or I get a strike. I don't know, right? Since it's the whole entire SEC and, and, and you know, Richard Hart is in the whole court case, all that stuff. I don't, I don't want to risk it, okay? So I will leave the hex token price on CoinGecko and you just scroll down and go to the website link right there. Okay. If you if you want to do that, create a dummy wallet, have enough funds on the Ether Ethereum network. Um, make sure you do all that stuff. Create a dummy wallet and just set it aside. Forget about it. This is, in my opinion, this is the best time, the perfect time to get into long term stakes for hex i've been waiting for this position i've been waiting for this scenario to play out i did not want to do any youtube videos or strategy videos or none of that throughout this whole entire sector this hole right here i did it i, I wasn't doing any any videos on hex and it was for a reason and i want to do this video out for everybody not just the members I don't want to do that this this video may end up just being a whole entire video for everybody not just for the members i don't know i will have to think about it um but i didn't do any hex videos throughout this whole entire scenario just because i didn't really see the you know a reason i mean there was reasons to but for me to be like okay now it's time to go crazy not right here it was taking profits around here you don't know me i got into hex at it was december of of 2019 i think it was whenever i got in december december something it was literally right here whenever i first got into hex and i sold for a about a 400 percent i'm sorry a 400 x that's whenever i just ran out of tokens to take profit from because it was just kept going up and i was just taking 10 percent, 20 percent. it was going up 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 i didn't get a chance to hold all the way up here but now i learned my lesson now what I'm going to do with Tynex is I'm going to be sure to have something for in case Tynex does this. But for Hex, man, now see, just 
I kind of want to say it's a no-brainer to do something, have something in here. So I went ahead and, and made create a dummy wallet, like I said, forget about it, and create some very long-term stakes. I would recommend doing a minimum of 300 days for X. I did 300 days all the way to 1,000 days, I think, if I remember correctly. 20, yeah, give or take, like, pretty much 20, uh, 1,000 days, almost right there at it. Like, I don't see why you wouldn't want to put $10, $50, especially right now because Ethereum gas fees are pretty low. Because by July 25th, 2027, X could be 100X from now. You know? I put in $1,000 in this dummy wallet. On my main wallet, I went ahead and put more. Like I said, it's all free money. It's all play money, monopoly money. I don't care what it does. It can go down 99.99%. It can go down, and I would not care because it's free money. But if it does great, then awesome, right? It's a win-win scenario. And I, th I think it's the best outcome that, that Hex will do 100x minimum uh, by the time I claim my tokens. You know, it's it's the strategy to do. I did twenty thousand pretty much every three, every two hundred, every hundred days. I think I started doing a hundred or two hundred days. Yeah, it was like plus three hundred, plus two hundred, plus two hundred. No, yeah, it's every one hundred days after three hundred days. Yeah, three hundred days, and then this one is four hundred days, and then five hundred days, six hundred, seven hundred, eight hundred, eight hundred. Yeah. Yeah, so give or take every 100 days after day 300, if you get if you guys get the drift. I'm going to hold on to these because, of course, there's that, you know, intake feature and all that stuff. 216,000 if Hex, if and when Hex even decides to do even 50 cents, right? That's $100,000. Anything is possible. Hex has that possibility, especially if, you know, he wins the case, which I'm pretty sure he won it by now. I'm pretty sure some people already have some valuable information ahead of everybody else before it gets announced and that's why we're seeing some crazy returns right now on everything on pulse chain and that's the that's the risk i'm willing to take yo free money to make me more free money it's something and i will be more than happy to see even i don't know even even if i make my money back i'll, I'll still be really happy i don't see why this wouldn't go to at least 10 cents by Maybe not tomorrow, maybe not a week from now, but by the time my claiming stakes come on through. So that's going to be an interesting little feature to do. Um, I'm diversifying my portfolio. Best case scenario, worst case scenario, you know, all that stuff. I'm in Tynex. Of course, I still have my Zen. That's claim, claiming still. My Zen NFT and my Batchments. Um, my Pulse Chain Zen is still claiming every single day, making me some revenue. Uh, Tynex protocols making me some revenue as well. So, like I said, man, don't be scared to go and get your feet wet somewhere else. It's okay. Like, I don't get too attached to one single project. Don't put your whole entire funds in one single basket. It could go really bad, or it could go really good. It's like you you you're relying too much on one single asset. Go get yourself some Binance, some Solana meme coins, some Pulse Chain meme coins. You know, that whole entire PDI. I got into a, into a BTC, rap BTC um, Pulse Chain, I think it was, at $72. It's right now at $2,200. Like, I'm telling you, I didn't even know it was that high. Like, out of nowhere, I logged into my Pulse Chain account, and I'm like, my jaw dropped. And it was thanks to me diversifying. So... Let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. Subscribe. I would love to see some of you guys be part of the private members. The join button is somewhere on my channel. If it doesn't pop up, I think you have to be on a uh, web browser. I don't know if it pops up on an app on your phone. I don't know if some people are having some issues behind that. But yeah, man, we'll see. We'll figure it out. I wish you guys the best and take it easy. I'm out. Peace.